Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome to the Chapter 9 finale of Let's Play Diz Gaia 2! Let's defeat Etna's Pretty Squad yet again, so that way we can get the Demon Lords now. Now, for this battle, you see we got this enemy boost geo effect that we need to deal with. So, and it's all the way in the back. So, I'm gonna need quite a few heavy knights to throw me around so I can get remotely close to them. There we are. So, yeah, let's just get Lloyd up there where he should be safe. And let's see, what do you got? Oh, you're weak to win. Okay, yeah, we can... Hmm, I was gonna say we can go with that. Yeah, let's do that. We don't have all the AoEs yet for win. There's nine AoEs that you could potentially get with spells, and all the, I don't know why they have all those empty spaces there, as though there are more, but they're not. So, just take what you can get. Now, the other problem that we have is we also have the red and blue panels, which can clone either your allies or the enemies. Oh, try that one again. The way it works is if you have an ally or an enemy standing on the geo symbols, it'll select one of them at random per color, and then it will, well, make a clone of them. Uh, both, whether it's an ally or an enemy that gets cloned, both of them will end up fighting against you. So you want to watch out for that. And also, when you do a clone of an enemy or ally, clones, you, you cannot steal items from them. So it's not like you could have a weapon or accessory or e emblem, whatever, and have the clone duplicate them and thus duplicate the item so you can get it again. Nah. No, it doesn't work that way. But anyway, okay, so let's get up here then. Try to draw out some of those printies up front. Oh, yeah, I'm going to be, uh... What is that? Short-handed here for a little bit. Eventually, I will try to send as many of my heavy knights back to the base panel so I can bring out my other party members. Pretty, dude! Pretty, dude! Oh, I think he was saying ready to use. But, okay. Ha ha, thanks for injuring your ally there. Dude. Whoa. Well, thank you for not hitting my other guy. Dude. Gosh, I hope enough of these guys are going to survive. Dude. Let's see, I had six heavy knights. They killed four of them. So, let's see, two, and then I had the four allies. Yeah, I'll have enough. Barely, but I'll have enough. Okay, so, let's see. This guy... Oh, you're also weak to win. Nice. Hmm. Okay, let's do it this way, then. Hmm. Okay, never mind, then. I'll just get a little closer. There you are. Ha-ha! Now, I would like Lloyd to come back to us over here eventually, but, well, we got a whole bunch of printies in the way. So yeah, we got rid of the two clone geo symbols, so now we can just go nuts. Hmm. Okay, let's go with a good asteroid drop. Try to keep my distance from the enemies a little bit. Whoa! I'm surprised you could one-shot that guy, but I suppose I did give you a new spear. Okay, let's see what else I can do. Let's get you guys out of there. Okay, I'm gonna go from the side instead of behind that printy, so I can spread out my party members a little bit, because, well, those guys have some AoEs for us to deal with. So let's see, Rosalind, Krona, and Tiana could use the most experience, even with that team kill we got on that level 70 monster there. Yeah, we're still a little bit behind, but it's not a big deal. Now I don't need to worry about the the geo panels anymore or symbols. Hmm. Let's see. Basically, I want to stay out of the way of as many of the printings as I can, but that's kind of hard for me to do. So, hmm. Okay, let's go with this then. Maybe just soften this guy up a little bit. Hopefully, none of the other printings will come my way. 
Yeah, Rosalind needs a lot of levels. Ready, dude. Well, we don't need it. It would just be yeah. nice to have. Pretty, dude. I'm surprised you dealt so little damage there. But I suppose it is Krona, so. And the new spear. So, let's see. Yeah, we should be able to one shot that guy. Haha! Okay, let's see. What do you got? Hmm. Yukimaru might be able to one shot that guy. Let's give it a shot. Why not? Or a slice. But, yeah, same difference. Yeah, she's got him. Haha! Well, she was a little behind Adele and the others anyway. Let's see how well I can move around here. Hmm. If I go there, I could probably have Adele just throw her to safety there. That'd be nice. Hopefully I just won't draw the attention of any more of those printies. Hmm. Yeah, let's just kind of spread out a little bit. See, can I get Lloyd back to safety? Hmm. No one's gonna be able to pick him up. Yeah, I think I'll just leave well enough alone. Just get a little closer. But I don't think the printies can hit me from all the way down there. Yeah, maybe I can have Krona finish that guy off. Yes, we can! Assuming I get close enough. Yeah, we should be good. Oh, okay. Well then, let's keep on going. Well, I guess I don't need to get Lloyd to safety. But it would be nice to be able to take out a lot of these guys. Let's see. Okay, not too many of them are weak to win. I'd like to be able to use Rose Thorns on these guys, but that pillar is in the way. I could maybe kill two of them like that, though. Hmm. How is, uh... Yukimaru doing there. Okay. I was thinking she might have Moon Slash yet, but... Or now. But, yeah, she's still a long way away. You gotta get her up to level 6 to learn that one. So, oh, we'll save it for later. Now, let's see. I could hit two of them. But then, I think the other two would come after her. But, I'll risk it. Okay, let's go... Like that. Rosalind? Yeah, that ought to do. As long as he doesn't get any crits. That's nice. Yeah, it's nice to get a little AoE action out of Rosalind there. And... Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I can get some more work for my... Proximal shot now. If I can actually see what they're doing. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Ow. Fortunately, the two printies up top there, they'll pretty much never move. Because they think they're still on the... The clone geo effect there for some reason. So, let's get out of harm's way there. Let's see. Okay, I want to get there eventually. Okay, yeah. Let's back up a little bit. Let's see, no one else really needs healing, so... Yeah, I'll just leave the rest alone there. Yeah, nice thing about getting up to there with the shoes. Could stay out of range a lot easier. Hmm... Okay, I need to get in a little shot on that guy. So, yeah, if I go there, I should barely be in range. And I should still have enough room for proximal shot. Yes, we do! Haha! -ha. I hope those printies don't jump down now. Usually what I end up having to do is... use some of my long-range attacks to hit those guys. And they'll just sit there letting me pummel on them forever, practically. Hmm, okay. Yeah, that'll be better. 
Well, this battle's moving along a bit faster than I thought it would. Yep, they're just gonna sit right up there. Unfortunately, they're too high for any of my abilities to be able to hit them, so we just gotta do this the old-fashioned way. Fortunately, regular attacks, especially with ranged weapons, seem to have a very high height tolerance. But even so, it seems... I don't know exactly what the height tolerance is on ranged attacks. Okay, we'll just wait for the next round then. I was a little worried that if I had Tiana attack again, that she might kill the guy because she deals a bit more damage there. All oh, right. Ooh, a cell phone. I wonder what that one is. Oh darn, we lost. Oh, you don't seem that upset about it. What about us, dude? Is she really gonna kill us? Yep, you're all gonna die again. There you go, one clipping from a demon lord. Ah. Well, thank you. Surprise. Are you sure it's okay? A promise is a promise. Oh, well, thank you. Right, a promise. We, um, we better get going. Well, goodbye. And we'll never see her again. You're a pretty nice person. Well then, let's get out of here. <laughs> What's so funny? What's so funny, dude? <laughs> oh, just a little prank. Huh? That wasn't my nail. I gave him a little devil sticky nail. I bought a whole box of them on the Netherworld Shopping Channel. Where'd you get the money for that sort of thing? Why would you do that, dude? Because if I had to fight a fake Overlord Xenon, then they do too. Well, what does that have to do with anything? Besides, this planet is boring. We didn't tell you that we were going to use it to summon Overlord Xenon. <laughs> what a dork. You're a pretty nice person. <laughs> well, Roslyn seems to be mellowing out a bit. <laughs> nope. I thought it might be fun to watch, but a promise is a promise. <laughs> We're doomed, dude. <laughs> We're all gonna die. There, everything's ready. We can now summon the strongest demon in the world. Do you have to say that so dramatically? Well, Zenon, of course. It's gonna be Overlord Zenon. That's why we got the Demon Lord Nail, remember? Oh, I'm trembling with anticipation, Zam. I feel the need to go to the little froggy's room. Oh, perhaps it is already too late. <laughs> Ice-grilled newt, toad oil, mushroom juice, a bacon stretcher, and a demon lord nail. We have everything! You want a diaper there? Here we Tink. go! Finally! The real Overlord Xenon! So we're just gonna summon him from wherever he is, and then ambush him <laughs> immediately. Shouldn't you be, I don't know, trying to stop them, Rosalind? I mean, I know you want to meet your father and all that. I wonder what the significance of the flute there is, anyhow. Spirits of darkness and light, in the name of Adele, I hereby summon the strongest demon in the world! Will it actually work? Well, let's find out right now. The... 
Serves you right. Why'd we summon Edna? Maybe she's the most powerful demon in the world. Oh, what went wrong this time? Yeah, I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> Hello, babies. It's time for the news. How did you get a job there? After news got out about the legendary Overlord Zenon's defeat, Overlords from around the universe are on the move. But we've already been conquered. It seems everyone is now gunning for this Etna, with the hope of claiming the title of God of all Overlords for themselves. Ha <laughs> ha. Veldheim looks to become ground zero for Netherworld War 7163. Aren't you guys always at war, pretty much? But enough about that. For the real news of the day, we'll take a special look inside a day of my life since my dramatic return. Yeah, he seems to be mellowing out a bit, too, huh? He came back home, alive. But that's not him. What do you mean? Nah, I wouldn't worry about it. But I wonder how Edna is doing after being summoned by all of us. Find out next time in Chapter 10 of Let's Play Disgaea 2. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.